Dear students, welcome to my channel, Dr. V. R. Pudli, Professor of Management and Economics. In this video, I am dealing with how to make exam fee payment in ERP. This video is being made exclusively for the usage of BBA students of Kale University. Dear students, for making exam fee payment, you log into your ERP account, then check for fee payment tab, click it. After that, you can find my payments tab, my sum fee structure tab, verify fee payment status online, pay transport, pay hostel, pay exam section certificates, pay end sum exam fee, pay tuition fee, pay certificate course fee, pay individual courses fee, pay re-registration fee, pay placement, pay sports and so on tabs. For now, we have to pay NSM exam fee. Click NSM exam fee. Here you have to select your year. Here I am selecting second year and semester even sum. Select exam regularity. You are writing regular exams now. Click get subjects list. Then you verify here whether all your subjects were there or not. So here one cost accountancy, two production and operations management, three business law, four financial management, five business model generation, six management information system and seven dynamics of capital markets are there. So verify whether all courses are checked or not. After that, you give your email ID here. So for now, I am giving my email ID. And you give your phone number. After that, select currency format, Indian rupees. Here you have to select bank. It doesn't mean that you need to have uh, bank accounts with HDFC and ICICI. You are using some uh, means of, uh, of payment or you are selecting some bank through which you are going to make uh, the payment. Here I am selecting ICICI EJ Pay. Click proceed to pay button. Dear students, you can check different modes of payment here. Here net banking, debit card and credit card options are given. For now, I am selecting credit card option. Once you give the credit card option, it will ask whether it is a domestic credit card or corporate credit card. I had chosen domestic credit card and I am proceeding now. And I am choosing my card type and it will ask to continue. Then I have to write card holder name and so on and other details. Continue button. Then I need to enter OTP. I am waiting for the OTP. I got the OTP number. Then after entering OTP number, we have to submit. and payment is successful and you can print the receipt here you can see the receipt dear students you can verify your exam fee payment status by login into your erp account again here 
check free payment tab click free payments tab and you can find verify fee, fee payment status online tab here you have to paste your uh, order id if you search we get uh, the payment detail online fee payment report live status here you can find the mode through which you paid and whether it is successful or not dear students you can download your hall ticket one day before the examination from the erp itself you can see the hall ticket tab on the day or one day before the examination you can click hall ticket tab and select your uh, academic year uh, and semester here year 2 and even semester and uh, select uh, exam type regular and when you click get hall ticket tab you will get uh, hall ticket on one day before the examination dear students you can view your payment status in uh, view my payments uh, tab of your erp account for this purpose you can log into your erp and click uh, fee payment tab again then you can see the first tab under fee payments my payment click my payment the students you can observe the payments that you have done under uh, my payments tab you can see the examination uh, fee paid uh, receipt here by clicking the icon so we can observe that we got the receipt for the examination fee payment.